Standing underneath the lights Look into each other's eyes Tired snowflakes are coming down Well, isn't that a good little find? I have literally seen this at Eddie Bauer. This is a current year jacket. I have seen this. I haven't tried it on before because I was like, oh, I'm not spending that much money on a jacket. But no, I was looking for jackets. Remember that? Yeah. I just got it for 10 bucks. <laughs> I wasn't looking for a jacket, but I couldn't find any workout stuff. I don't want workout pants. I need workout shorts and tank tops. And they literally don't have tank tops or shorts or short sleeve shirts in the whole store. So I couldn't do that. I didn't even plan on coming to Goodwill this morning. I didn't even plan on leaving the house, which is why I'm wearing the exact same thing I was wearing yesterday afternoon. <laughs> Literally, the exact same thing. I was sitting at home. I had just sat down to my computer um, after getting the kids to school. Um, funny story about that in a second. Um, and I got an, a text message from the secretary that does the scans that I volunteer for. And she said that one of their um, volunteers had um, gotten sick this morning and couldn't come in and wanted to know if I could come in. And it was to uh, examine the ladies. And that pays more because, you know, it's invasive. And but anyway, so I went and the tech that I actually had, she, she doesn't do it very often, I, I can tell, because <laughs> she just let the ladies hang out, which normally, they kind of cover them up and they go underneath the towel and they make it more discreet. No, not this one. I digress. Anyway, they had asked me to come in, so I did. And it was last minute, they were like, we need you now, because the volunteer was supposed to be an hour before. So, rushed out of the house, went and did the scan, ended up only being an hour long, so I was like, let's go to uh, the Goodwill. It's called Value Village for us. But, I am gonna go home and wash it, but, I literally have seen this. I know it's crazy colors or whatever, but like, who cares? And uh, now I have a little jacket, so you don't have to see this one all the time. Because often I just want to wear a t-shirt. A I have a t-shirt on underneath here. But I wear the same like cover-ups all the time. But I would rather just put on a jacket and go out. So, um, oh, and then the funny thing is, I was headed to the scan this morning and I was driving through a neighborhood and I was like, why are there kids at the bus stop right now? And I looked at the wa my watch and I was like, oh, Chelsea hasn't left for school yet. <laughs> Chelsea was still at home. And I just like left the house. She's fine to be home alone. She's, um, she's almost 13. But I was, so I called her and I was like, sorry, I just left. And she's like, yeah, I was wondering why you didn't leave without saying goodbye. I was like, I'm really sorry, but she was literally getting her backpack and getting ready to go outside, clearly, because I saw all the kids at the bus stop. Um, so I've just had a weird morning, and then I ran into someone. Um, she actually was a customer at Gymboree when I worked at Gymboree at the mall years and years ago. She was a regular customer with her and her daughter while they waited to pick up her husband. And we really got to know each other. And that sounds funny, but now you know my personality. I get to know people from across the country and the world. Um, and I've never even met any of you guys. So you know that I just make friends with people. <laughs> so, um, but I've gotten to know her and her daughter goes to the same high school that my daughters go to. And so she, I think was at the game when Kaylee got hurt, um, when she had her little uh, dislocated knee happen or whatever. And anyway, I didn't remember that she was there. I think I probably had seen her. It was homecoming game. That's why she was probably there. Um, anyway, I just ran into her here at this Goodwill and she was like, oh my goodness, I don't know if you remember me. And I look like crud. And I was like, oh, I look like, I, I don't look put together either. Anyway, we got talking and she asked about Kaylee and she's like, how is your daughter doing? She was injured at that high school game. and. It was just, it was good to follow up with her. She's like, I've been so worried about her and I, my daughter doesn't really know her and doesn't know how to like find out if she's okay. And I thought that was very kind of her. Um, but then we got talking about scholarships and going to college and her daughter did all the scholarship work, and <laughs> found scholarships and got into schools and all that kind of stuff herself. And I was like, oh, you are so lucky because it is such a process. So. Now it's 11.45 and I'm gonna go home. 
I don't, I don't know what else to do. I have to be on a call for therapy with Ashley. Well, not with Ashley. She'll be in school. She's got her recess coach meetings today. And then, um, what do I have? Oh, and then I have to pick her up from her meeting. So, and then I'm hoping to go to the community center again tonight and walk um, while she does her cheer. That's why it wasn't even working out when they called me, which was a good, it was good timing. But I am kind of bummed that I couldn't find any workout gear. I'm gonna wait, you know, like another month or two and then come back here and see if they have like their shorts and tank tops and stuff out, at least for workout stuff. Um, because I don't really want to pay full price because I think I can go down a size again. But you guys, this one, did you notice? It was an extra large. And it was, I mean, I could stretch it. It was big. So I don't want to pay full price for things. Oh, there's someone behind me. Um, if I'm going to go down another size. So I will be taking you guys' advice and checking here more often and getting things cheaper until I really kind of, not plateau, but like get to a good like, okay, I'm this size and it'll probably stay that way for a little while. Um, it might take like a whole year, a whole like season, going through every season, you know what I mean? to try and determine, okay, where am I at? Where am I gonna stay at? So, gotta save money where we can. Okay, I'm listening to a little Sister Wives podcast. It's quite good. Oh, there's an Ashley. Where is she? Hi. Hi. Recess coach. Yeah. How are you doing? Good. Guess what came in the mail today? My pictures. Your pictures came. She's gonna decorate her wall. Yes? Oh, um, yes, buckle up. Someone gave me something to give to you. Well, okay. I can keep it or you can, but. Stop. So my friend is like a little, uh, I don't know what her position is. She works here at Ashley's school. Oh my gosh, she is so cute. She's like old school. Like she loves to get patches like this herself and she sews it on to like um, Goodwill like jean jackets and stuff or her son's backpack. Oh my gosh, she probably saw this and immediately thought of me. Oh, what can we do with this, Ashley? That is so cute. That is so, 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 so cute. My friends do know me. That is really cute. So I'm gonna have to send her. The thing is, like, this friend is so genuinely old school that I will send her a card. She literally lives, like, right around the corner. <laughs> but I am going to send her a genuine thank you card because with maybe a little treat in there for herself. Um, because that is so cute and out of the blue. I really actually haven't seen her um, She does like the what does she do? Recess, the recess helper. recess helper and then she works in the school when they're in school um, But then she also does the little crossing guard in the morning So I've been seeing her in the in the mornings at the crossing guard um, All the teachers and admin kind of help out with things like that before school. So anyway, very cute fun surprise Okay, Ashley wants to show the pictures she ordered. She picked these all out online. Very colorful. You kind of picking out like color patterns. Maybe do like this like block up. I don't know. Find a pattern that maybe works. She's gonna put these on her wall, right? Correct? Mm -hmm. Correct? Mm -hmm. Okay, why are you being so silent? All right, well, it, she she definitely picked a good, like, color scheme. Those they are all the same. kind of go together. They are the same. So. Yeah. But maybe it'll help tie them together, like, two different spots. All right, the last thing I want to be doing right now is getting ready to go walk at the gym. I don't call it, it's just the community center. Well, Ashley goes to cheer. It's really, honestly, I've been on the couch for the past hour. <laughs> this is literally the last thing I want to do right now, but I would probably feel more guilty. Well, I would definitely feel guilty sitting in my car, like just sitting on my phone waiting for her. And it's just not worth coming back home. And then going back out. So I'm doing it, but someone, oh man, who was it? Pam? You guys have been sending me messages all day long, so I can't keep straight who's <laughs> said what. Um, I'd have to look at it again. Um, 
but I tried on um, all these shorts. I haven't mentioned it before, but I tried all these shorts on. I got rid of all of these. I think there's three pairs of shorts and a pair of like capri style um, cargo pants or whatever. Um, but I, I'm not worried about like, these are my little, you know, beachy shorts. I'm not worried about those, but I think it was Pam. I don't remember who it was, but they said, make sure you try on your swimsuit because the last thing you want that to, to happen is for this to fly off <laughs> in the water because it's too big. You guys haven't had that problem before. I literally have not had that problem before. And this is now my favorite swim top. And I have a problem. Oh, I have my phone telling me that I set a two, two hour timer in case I fell asleep on the couch, which I did not. Um, I do have like swim shorts that I actually need to try on. Make sure these don't fall off because you want these things to be tight. So I might need to try those on. And, um, you know, I was, when I'm doing the 2022 review video, I don't like myself in this swimsuit anymore. I'm tossing that one. I looked larger in that one. I'm not going to do it tonight, but I do need to try on some of these like swim stuff and get new stuff ordered because I kind of have a feeling, I really hope this one's not, um, too big. But I know where I can order it because this is the fourth one I've ordered. <laughs> I can just go back to my history on Amazon. Um, I have a fun thing coming up. You'll see in my Hawaii videos, like my packing videos. I have a fun little pair of shorts that I'm going to surprise myself with and someone else in the family with. You'll have to wait and see. But I'm going to get dressed into this. Okay, guess what? Try it on a swimsuit. It's a little bit big. But... I, I think part of my problem is I'm accustomed to having things like if it's if it fits regardless if it's a little bit big I've been accustomed to having that be the norm instead of downsizing I've always had to upsize and so I've always accepted if something's just a little bit loose I allow it to be loose but I kind of like tucked the ladies up a little bit and I was like, ooh, if I had this one tighter, it would look better. It doesn't happen. That doesn't happen. <laughs> I'm gonna have to see where I'm at in a couple, like in a month. I'll see where I'm at in a month. And then maybe I will get a better swimsuit. I'm gonna still take that one because I still like that one. Unless I'm like just swimming in it, which I don't think I will be. These things aren't going anywhere. <laughs> My stomach is, but the ladies are not. So let's go to the gym. Look how cute my new jacket is. 10 bucks, man. I can't find it on Eddie Bauer anymore, so it must have been old enough to not be there. Wow, this lighting. All right, I officially did. Ashley wants me to give her my watch so she can see how many steps she does. Yeah, I could take dad's in the <laughs> You could morning. put dad's, yeah, but he likes to have it during the day. So I did a total of 12,000 steps and 5.71 miles today. You should take a picture of it. Which was mostly, I probably did a full 10,000 steps tonight. Wait, did you, did you like... Because I only walked in with 2,000. Did you walk, <laughs> did you walk um, like at home when I was at school? No, I because I got called for a scan like super last minute, so I had to go out. So that doesn't mean next week I have to beat that. So her coach just now, she whispered, well, she kind of yelled at her as she walked out. She's like, go sign up for tumbling. Because yeah, she wants her, she's so close to getting her backhand like I give too much spring. power in my round off and that's like what yeah. you had to have for backhand spring, but in cheer they don't yeah. do. So we just didn't do tumbling this time because she was kind of getting too tired at night doing both of the classes. I wonder if this guy's trying to wait for my parking spot. Um, or no. Um, I, it's already been started, so I'll just yeah. see if it's cheap enough, because well, the chair is more to, expensive. I have to talk to the, the person who wants me to Well, join. I can see if it's full or if it's closed. Well, I to, yeah, I also have to if talk If it's full to or closed, we can just talk to them next week and ask if we can just join in. Yeah. So, but anyway, I am pretty tired, and I remembered I have a... $14 credit on my Cafe Rio account. So I'm gonna go get myself a salad. And Kaylee's like, oh, you can get me one too. But I think I might just get it for myself. 
I don't know. We'll see. But we're going to go, right? We're going to say goodnight to you. Well, we'll just kind of go. We'll see what we get. I'm very hungry. Jason stayed after. Well, he didn't stay after work. He stayed after to do, to do a few things. The, compu the printer that he just bought does not sync with his computer because he has such an outdated computer. But it would cost him about ten dollars to $12,000 to upgrade his computer and it, all of his software and accounting system. It would cost us so much money. And that's probably just the start of it. It's probably upwards of fifteen dollars to $20,000 to upgrade everything that he really truly needs to do. So the printer won't connect to it. So he needs like an old school printer that just literally like will plug in and not need any 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 software connected to internet or Wi-Fi or anything fancy. He just needs an old school to print out accounting documents. So we're gonna go and switch those printers and see if my old one will work and I get a new one at home. Not that I need it for a ton of stuff. Um, and then after he did that tonight, he uh, went straight to meet a rep. If you guys were here last year, we met with this rep in a hotel down in Bellevue and then Jason took me to dinner kind of glad that that wasn't an option for tonight because I just wanted to do this and I need to shower so I was not ready for a fancy night out so let's go okay mm -hmm. all right we have secured the salad and a quesadilla because the quesadillas are free so we're gonna go get her a smoothie correct mm -hmm. and I told Kaylee no on the salad I told her I need to earn more points and then she can have a salad or the reality is she has a job. She can come get a salad anytime she wants to. She's almost an adult. Gotta start figuring that kind of stuff out, my friend. We have Max here. Max, come! Hi, Max. Oh, he's going right. Well, Dad said it. Dad said the magic words, so. Dad said peanut butter. Right, Max? Are you going to get some peanut butter? Are you going to get it? No, oh, come here. Ashley's getting it. Look. Max, look. Max, look. She's getting it. Oh, it's too tempting. All the people upstairs or... Yeah, yep. You want some? Sit. Sit. Don't do it. Sit, Max. Good boy. Do you like peanut butter? Do you like peanut butter? Good boy. He only does that. Oh, good boy. That's enough. That's enough. Oh, okay, oh, slow down. No, slow down. I don't know how they do a whole scoop of it at one time. It's so much. All right, well, we're going to end with Max. Max can say goodnight to everyone. Say goodnight, Max. <laughs> He'll lick this thing dry. <laughs> and he'll have it all over his face. Easy.